This episode of the show is brought to you by such patrons as Gordo, Dharma Wheelies, Benjamin, Big Boy Farts 666, Crispy 808, Despicable Dogs, Electro Pirate, Fancy Pants, It's Leon Motherfucker, Jesus Penis, Anonymous, MST3 Clay, Phone Losers of America, Turbo the High Level Squirrel, and Parkman. Thanks to everyone for supporting the show. You can find out more at immoralhole.com. You can find our live show at immoraljuice.com. You can find our archives at travelswithmiriam.com. You can find our Patreon at patreon.com forward slash madhouse militia. You can also donate to the show via immoralhole.com forward slash show forward slash contribute. Slicker. Hi. Do you have the lick? Do we have what? The licorice loop. One more time. The licorice whip. Do we have licorice whip? That's the one. Is that what you're saying? Licorice whip? Yes. I, I've never heard of it. I I uh it's a is um let me put my brother on. Okay. Uh. Hello. Hi, I'm the brother. Excuse don't me. Know what the licorice whip is. I I'm can't. I can't hardly hear you. you know much what... less even understand you. Let me put my other brother on then. Hello there. Hello. Oh, okay. Hi. You got a lot of brothers. Well, who am I talking with now? This is Ace Liquor. How can we help you? Oh yeah, we're looking for the liquor. Yeah, we got the liquor. It's here. We got liquor, all kinds of liquor here. All right, well, now we want a bottle of rye and a bottle of whiskey, and we want to mix the two and see what happens. Come on, we got it. Come on down. All right. All you right, got bye-bye. the color do. Thank you. Fuck you. I think that's how it's set up. Hello. Turn that shit off. Hi, Hello. I think that's how it's set up. You know, you, you tie a rope around the bottle... And then you run and you I duck got, and cover. I all day. Right? But I, I, hey, I find it. Is this? Hello. This is me, I find it. Hi. This is a liquor store. Yeah, I need a bottle of that stuff that has the rope in it. Which one? It's the dope on a rope. It's It says dope on a rope. It has a picture of the phone. Which one liquor store? You, which liquor bar are you talking about? I'm talking about the one, you know, It's it's got the big rope on it. Big rope one. I think it's, it's a rum. It's rum. It's it's a bottle of like white rum, clear rum. Uh huh. It has a big rope on it with a big root sticking out. Okay. And you put the root in your mouth. So okay. And you suck so, on the root. So what do you need? I need the root. I need your root. When you bite. Well, no, I'm going to buy it. I was I was calling to see if you had Big Root. Big Root Rum Big Liquor. Root. I know, but do you have, what's the name on the liquor? It says Big ru- Root Rum. Big Root Rum? Yeah. And there's a stupid guy over there. He said, oh, 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 you know. He said, oh, uh, show me. I have it. I have the big root. Come here. And he pulled down his trousers and he showed me his root. Uh, I don't think so. I think I might sold out. Some rum. Yeah, I sold out. Daddy, give me some rum. And I'm my sorry, grandpa I wants out. rum. You're sold out of rum? Okay, do you I have whiskey? Rum. You have vodka? <laughs> what, what Which one has the biggest root on it? Uh, I don't know. You come yeah, here. Yeah. You come here. You show me. Okay, you show me when I when I get there. Okay. Okay. Please, I need rum. Big Gondu rum. Hey, uh, thank you for coming, Tom. This is Jeff. I can help you. Hi, Jeff. Hello. How you doing tonight? I'm well. Hi. Good. I'm just wondering if you have um. 
licorice rum. You mean like anise flavored? Yeah, anise. Anise. Yeah, I've got uh, I've got it in a uh, liqueur. Okay, you have the anise flavored. The, yeah, the anise. Alcohol. Okay. All right, let me put my brother on. Um, he was looking for the asshole uh, flavored one. <laughs> I, I need some anus rub. I need some anus rub. You got the anus flavored rub? It tastes like anus. <laughs> well, depending on your taste, that could be all or most of them. Oh, man, I like a chocolate flavored anus, too. Starfish is delicious. <laughs> you got some of that, buddy? Man, we're going to have a party over here. Sounds like you've already had one. Yeah, like, you want to call somebody else and harass them or what? I'm already. Oh, man, I harass you. I just wanted to find out if you carried an anus flavored rum. <laughs> I missed white. Economy. Hi, I missed white. 338. What do you say? I missed white. Uh, it's a type of alcohol, uh, anise flavored. I don't know if you have it. Missed white? You say lemon. Okay. Yeah, missed white. Yeah. No, we don't have that, sir. So. Okay, do you have Mr. Dwight? No. Okay. Do you have Dwight flavor? Uh, Dwight uh, vodka, I think it's called. Dwight, Dwight. Why? Hold on, hold on, hold on, just a second. Hello? Okay. Oh, hello. I'm bring my brother. He's he's here. He's coming. He's coming. Oh, hello. How about if we Where's the Hello. hello. Hello? Hello, yeah, what do you need? Hi, yeah, I was looking for Dwai, uh, lick, uh, vodka? Uh, Dwai, Dwai? Yeah, Dwai, or it's, it's like, it has like a, a Y in it, and it's oh. clear, it's clear liquor. Oh, we don't have. You have, uh, you have whiskeys, rice? No. Right, we have no. rye whiskey. We have rye whiskey. You have uh, 1776? That's my favorite rye. 76? What kind? What do you mean for 76? Well, 19, uh, 1776, you know, the year uh, America became America. Actually, it was ratified in 1781, but 1776, we fought the revolution against those damn Brits, you know? Let me check. Like, you know, Nunu, he's, he's a Brit. He's a motherfucker. He's a red coat. Oh, he's demanding us Americans to do Jimmy things Roy. for him. We don't have a 76 something. We have Jimmy Drive. Oh. You have the Gandu or the Galmutra? No. Oh. That's uh, that's cow urine. No, I don't they have They ferment it, and sometimes they drink it straight from the tap. No, I don't have Nunu no. likes to drink it that way. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Do you have vintage white 1947? <laughs> he likes to bathe. Sounds liquor. Thanks, uh, you went on that trip. Hello? 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 Hi. Um, yeah, I was wondering, um, do you guys have a pretty large selection there? Of what? Of... Like liquors, is it just your basic like name brands, or do you have like artisanal, like smaller brands? It's pretty basic. Okay, um, I'm trying to get something for my daughter's birthday party. She's turning 16. Um, do you know one that the kids like these days? Like any particular we'll brand? Kids, no, no, we'll I'm buying. It. I'm buying it. I'm just asking about. Yeah, I'm I'm buying it. I'm not a kid, but do you know what? Well, they don't really make people? it for kids. They make it for people over 21. So. Yeah, I'm over 21. Just pretend I'm drinking it all. So, do you know of like a good kind for like maybe like junior high age, like? Why well, would no man? I don't know. Like Boone's Farm. What do you or... what? 
They still what are you that. Dr- what are you trying to like drink here? Whiskey, vodka. Um, I don't know what's cheap, but like gets you really drunk. I don't know. I don't drink. Like if I had never had alcohol before, if I had never had alcohol before, and I was born after two thousand, what would I drink? Water. Do you know? All right. Uh, I don't drink water. Sure, what beverage? Hi. How are you doing? Good. How are you? I'm great. I'm looking for a bottle of Dwy vodka. Hmm. Spell that for me. The first part. I'm not sure. It was someone on the phone told me it was called Dwy. Might have been Dwight. But they said Dwy. Dwy. Uh, let's see. Well, that is not ringing any bells. I'm taking maybe Dwight a- tea. Like, like it's a hard tea. Maybe I'm not really sure. Because they told well, me it was like a hard, hard vodka, but maybe it's like a, a twisted truth. tea. Well, yeah, I think you said it was called Dewine. It was called Dewine, I think. Huh. Well, we Wine? do have a hard truth, but it's a cinnamon vodka. But we don't have any Dewine or Dwight or. Anything like that, vodka? You have Gordo beer? No, we sure don't. Uh, uh, let's see. You have uh, peanut schnapps? What kind of schnapps? Peach? Peanut? Or peanut butter schnapps? No, we got some peanut butter whiskey. So we got some screwball, but no schnapps. Let's see what I get out here. I have a butter. Have like a hazelnut Nutella sort of thing? I know I have a creme de caco, but that's more of a chocolate. No nutty type. I still haven't figured out any keto, any keto liquors, any keto liquors. What about Perk Thirties? Perk Thirty. Keto friendly. Say that one more time. Perk Thirty. No, sure don't. It's a, it's a rum. Hmm. Do you have a snappy beer? I love that stuff, Dimitri, that the dead likes, the Dimitri vodka. Dimitri, D I M I T R I. Dimitri, ask her. No, no, Dimitri. I can hear him too. Oh. We're on speakerphone. He hasn't realized it. He's been oh. um, token all day, you know? Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah. Uh, well, Ooh. no, Dimitri, I'm sorry. And again, okay. we have like a. Nutty whiskeys, but we don't have any type of. Uh, How do they make nutty whiskeys? Like, whose nut is it? <laughs> well, there's a Ballantine caramel turtle. Um, we have a bird dog peanut butter flavored whiskey. And that's a salt caramel. And then we have the screwball that's a peanut butter whiskey. Is there a spider web yeah. whiskey? PB99. Is that that peanut butter PB99? Oh, yeah. I had oh, a that's friend. that's like one of those 99. No, yeah, like yeah, the we... banana 99 or something like that. That was the right. first thing I ever got drunk on. Yeah. Yeah, we don't carry ago. that flavor. In fact, uh, our distributor Damn. stopped ordering the 99s because they're getting ready to switch over to the 50 meals. 50 meals? Soon. Oh, yeah. the smaller. In August oh. 1st, we're going to be able to start selling those individually instead of as packs. So uh, everything's changing. Oh man, there's like a little airplane bottles there, the little nippers. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> now we do have a butter pecan old smoky moonshine. It's probably about as close to the ninety. Oh hell, that little bit. Sweet, a real moonshine, a little sweet. Yeah, yeah, it is pretty sweet. There's a Appalachian sipping cream, the yeah. peanut butter flavored one of those too. It's made by Sugarland. It is actually really good. Some of that. That sounds good. Peanut butter cup. Oh heck, I'm getting hungry. <laughs> Let's get some of this, man. Let's get some of that, Okay, but I I've been drinking. How do we get there? Uh, you might want to wait until oh, tomorrow. Oh shit! Can they? <laughs> yeah. Can they deliver? Ask them if they deliver. Well, can I they can deliver. Delivery? We'll give. 
We can deliver. Yeah. We can call. Yeah, we'll deliver. And we'll deliver. Normally we do deliver, but at the moment we're not able to. There's only two of us here, and we don't leave anybody alone. So we don't really deliver after 5 p.m., and it has to be within Whoa. a certain time. Whoa! 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 Oh, 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 the humanity. Oh. 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 I'm trying. I lost my flip flop. That hurt. Uh-huh. Next time you're playing video games. I lost my flip flop. Yeah. I've got it all lost my flip flop. Yeah. It's okay. It'll be yeah. okay. Okay. Okay, I hit reset. Okay. My leg's hanging out. It's okay. You guys okay? Yeah, so I'm a flip flop. Are you? Yeah. Yeah. I think we're gonna be all right. We're good. Restart yeah. the Nintendo 64. I want to do that again. <laughs> it looked cool, wasn't it? Yeah. I'm all shook up. Next time, hold on My to the steering broken. wheel. I can't feel a thing. My HP just went off the charts, man. There's so much blood. Oh. Here, I'll give you a health booster. Here you go. This booster pack here, a capsule. A capsule of good shit. Here you go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's better. Okay. We're going to go, okay? Thank you for your yeah. help. I love night. you. You guys all right? We love you. Yeah, we're fine. Yeah, we're all right. We just got a big buzz on. We love you, though. Thank you for playing. Good night. Good yeah. night. What do I win? Thank you. I do have baby mice in the pirate part. Hello? Yes, sir. Good evening, Alyssa. Hi, I'm a very sick, bad man. I'm very sick. I'm bad. Yes, sir. Yes, and I want alcohol to match my personality of being a very sick, bad man. Maybe quality has? That sounds like a pussy drink. That's, that's for that. But I'm a very sick and very bad man. That's why I, I want to convey that. To you. That doesn't sound right. Let me put my brother on. Maybe he knows. I don't know. Do you know, brother? You're wasting my I'm time. A very, you need it. Yes, I'm a very sick, bad man. I'm wasting your time. So you I'm don't want to do your shit bad. talk? Like you don't want to do your quality house like your shit talk? Oh, I don't hey, shit hey, talk, hey, sir. Hey, I don't know how. I'm very How about stupid. a bancho? How about a bancho? What did you say? Gamutra bancho. Do you sell gamutra bancho? What is it? Do you sell Galmutra Banchot? What is it? Pick your nose, not your ass. He's just sitting talk on me and wasting my time. What you need it? <laughs> Galmutra. That's all we're looking for. We put it in your hair and like a tonic and make your hair grow. Hey, this is uh, Tony. Go ahead. I'm listening. What do we need, boss friend? Hey, Tony. Yeah, we're looking for some Kalmutra. It's a type of vodka that's really popular in India. It's like uh, an American version of Kalmutra. We don't have it, buddy. Yeah, oh. we, don't, we don't sell it hey, here. My brother was looking for something. Oh, are you sure? My brother was looking for a 99. What was that 99 stuff you was looking for, brother Axel? Ninety nine, which way? Okay, I think it's called PB ninety nine. We're looking oh, for the Anis. Anis. Yeah. yeah. What is it? Thank you so much, sir. Anis ninety nine. Yeah. Nineteen ninety nine, Anis. Oh, uh, Boston. Yep. No, nope, don't sell that here too, man. I mean, try another liquor store, okay? We tried them all. You're the last one on the list. Buddy, that's it. Then that means we like liquors. Else. 
Yep, that's it. I mean, if nobody we else like has it, then uh, I guess, I mean, you guys need to uh, I guess it doesn't exist then. Instead of, you know, wanting to not do your job. You, any you anis? Know. You got any anus-flavored liquor? Any anus-flavored liquor? Let me ask you this uh, before I hang up the phone. You guys got nothing better to do, right? Must be real bored. No. We're going thirsty. Around, uh, you know, we would like to purchase. Asking for uh, dicks and pussy, huh? That's what you guys are doing right now? No, Tony. You want you're asking you know, for liquor. Hey, 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 we'll call again, okay? Hang up the phone. Now. Don't. Oh, call Tony, again? No, you hang come up. Come on, Tony. No, you hang up. <laughs> Tony. Maybe she went off. Hi. Hello? Hello? Hi. Yep. Do you have the Dwight wine? I'm sorry, what was that? Yeah, the Dwight wine. Dwight wine? Yeah, Dwight wine. Uh, we, White wine, yeah. No, 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 not, not white, no, 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 no. No, we don't have it. The wine, maybe. Divine D-wine. wine. Yeah, you got the wine. So thirsty. So selling the wine. It is made by the white company. Come in a blue bottle. Uh, uh, it's like a hunter CV kind of battle. You know the wine? The wine? We don't Please. have this. You could sell. How much? How much? How much? Quanto? How much? We do not carry that. We will buy. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah. we buy. The white, the wine. We like, yeah, yeah. We like a pump of blue. We come up and dive in the blue. Hello, thank you for calling ABC Stores 114. How may I help you? Hi, how open is it? We are closed at 10. Okay, and how under are you? What do you mean under? Well, everything's over under... We got flavored condoms. This is a liquor store, right? We sell a little bit of liquor. Yeah, a little bit. Well, I mean, we have bourbon, vodka... You have the stuff wine. that burns when you put it on your tongue, and when you, you like, you don't even, you can't even taste it. It doesn't really matter. It just burns. That's what I'm looking for. <laughs> um, we have 80 proof. Some are 92. 92. That's the number. That's the trick right there. Alrighty. All right. I'll be right there. I'll be Thank the man you. wearing no pants. Okay. Well, then you're gonna have to put on the pants. Well, I'm wearing shorts. Okay. Well, that's fine then. But they're skin colored, so it might look a little strange. But don't worry, I'm fully clothed. Well, that's fine then. Yeah, you might see an outline, but it's totally, you know, it's totally <laughs> concealed. Okay. All right. Thanks. Love you. Hey, B Market. Hi. You have uh, things other than. Hi, do you have things other than alcohol there? A cheese, uh, pretzels. Now you're asking for you have, cheese and pretzels. Yeah, do you have uh, the accoutrements or no, no? Is your name Dominic? No. Oh, so yes, we do have cheese and yes, we have pretzels. Okay. Now, this what like if a, my name was Dominic? Because that's that's my only question. Because you sound like my roommate. That's why I thought you were calling. Oh. You, you was no, talking with no. Me. <laughs> no, that'd be funny, though, wouldn't it? Hey, huh? It wouldn't have been. Don't tell him it's me. Don't tell him. I won't. Just shut up. All right. Uh, yeah. All right, okay. We'll, we'll be down there in a little bit. I mean, I'll be down there in a minute. Yeah. Yeah. So it is you. No, no. Uh, act like Liquor City. Hey, nobody acts uh really weird here. Sorry, what was that? Got it. Nobody acts really weird on the call. Oh, got it. Hey, oh, from Portland Suites. This is Sydney. How can I help you? Hi, we're in the room, and the toilet won't stop flushing. My brother, he put his his shoe, it got stuck, 
and now it's flushing, 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 and it doesn't stop, and it's making Are you buzzing up noises. Stairs? Yeah, we're up in the stairs. Yeah. Okay. Oh. All right then. Hello, well, Garden Motel. Hi, I have a consent form from my doctor. I have a constipation. And I just want to make sure with you that it's all right, because my doctor said it could crack the toilet when it finally goes. <laughs> Good. Okay. <laughs> all right. Uh, will you sign on the dotted line? Yep. All right. Perfect. I'll be there. I'm the man carrying the large garbage bag full of my own feces. Okay, good. All right. I love you. We'll see you. All right. Bye-bye. Say it back or it's weird. <laughs> you can't do that. Well, you gotta. That's yeah. the rule. No. Yeah, I love you. Okay. I, I love you. It's Friday. I can't say it back. Oh, why does it matter? <laughs> Good. It's Friday. All right. I guess I don't love you that that much anymore. Okay. All right. We'll see you. Bye. All right. All right. Goodbye. There's ink in that pit. Motel six. Motel six. Hi, is this Motel 6? This is Motel 6. Oh, good. Hi, how are you? I'm doing good. How are you doing? I'm okay. Look, I got my brother and my family here in the station wagon uh, SUV. We're trying to make it over there. Do you have any vacant rooms for tonight? We do. Give me just one second. I'm in the middle of um, checking somebody in. I think they're going for one bed. 127 and 135 for two beds for tonight. But we have both available at the moment. Okay. You get back to work, okay? I'm I'm a prank phone caller and I feel bad. All right. Your job. I'm sorry. All right. I'm I'm going to go now. Have a good All night. Right. You too. I love I love you. you. No, I think you for calling I best look from And this is Carrie. How can I help you? Hi, I think maybe the problem is, is that uh, they're so angry about the software that it it's just spun them off course, you know? Hello? Hi. Hi. How can I help I'm talking you? About, I'm talking about the software, you know? I tried to make a room booking with the software and it spun me off course. And I, don't know I what... was following the GPS to get there and it spun me off the road. Uh-oh, where are now, you at? Well, I'm not sure. The The car is upside down now. I just wanted to make sure you had rooms open for booking. Cause I am not sold out list- tonight. Oh, oh, God, no. Really? Yeah. Oh. Oh. Well, better, better call a tow truck then, because it's just blue in here, and I'm getting real tired. <laughs> where are you located? I'm in my car. Right, but where at? Oh, it's upside down. I'm not really sure. I can't really make out any landmarks. But it will, well, we have AAA. Everything will be fine. Okay. And maybe I could find a hotel through them that isn't overbooked and oversold like yours. Yeah, we are sold out. It's because of the internet, you know? If everything was done the old-fashioned way, there would be checks and balances in, in place, and everything would work out just fine. You don't need all the bells and whistles and the software, you know, the software that spun me out. Yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> okay, I love you, okay? Have a good all night. Right. Uh-huh. Bye. Okay. Bye. Poopity poopity do. Welcome oh. back. Riverview Lodge, may I help you? Yes, hi, hello? Hello, may I help you? Hello, hi, yeah. Um, I'm calling because of the problem in my uh, room. Okay, what is wrong? The sauce. The sauce is all wrong. Hello? 
That's Lester Mountain. James speaking. How can I help you? Hey, how you doing there, James? Not too bad yourself? Ah, I could be doing better. Listen, the sauce is everywhere up here. That's all you got. That's the response. I <laughs> the sauce. So- the sauce. I'd say, I just what you mean. I guess. Yeah, you were. You're supposed to ask me what I mean, and then I'll tell you. Um. Yes. I'm sorry. I'm just in the middle of a check-in, so I'm gonna have to put you on hold for a moment before I am able to help you. Further. The fuck you are. The fuck you are. Yeah, I'm in the middle of a check-in. Uh, here, can you sign? Listen, you put me on hold, and I will come in there, and I will tug my nuts at you. All right. Um, then yes, do you want me to put <laughs> you on hold then, or what is what seems to be the issue? I don't know. Issue? You want me to tug my you want me to tug my nuts at you? What's the what seems to be the issue? I don't know. You need a book I don't know room. The no, no. Well, I need another room. Another one. Another room. Mm. Another one. Okay. All right. Here again, I am in the middle uh, of checking. Because I want to. Because I want to. Because I want to. Because I want to go second. in and I want to fuck that. I want to. I want to fuck that one up too, and then I want another one. Uh, sir, I'm gonna need you to either uh, the, uh, stop uh, talking in this manner, uh, or you're one. gonna have to calm down. No, I, I will do none of those because I'm a red-blooded American. I got the meat sweats. I had a fucking big-ass steak. I got a 64-ounce steak at dinner. And now I'm sweating up here. The sauce is everywhere. I got the A1 sauce. I had the Heinz 57 on half of it. Keys to the room. Room number and Wi-Fi password is on there. Room itself is one floor up down the hall to the left. And we do offer breakfast 7 to 9. The hallway has the elevator, laundry room, and the way into the indoor garage. Feel free to park in there. Thank you. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Here you go. All right, so all right, so you're already in. What's your last name, then? Last name is Johnson. Mm. So you're not in, not in as right now. You were in yesterday, then? Yeah, but I'm still here. Uh, what's the first name? The first name is Kevin. Hmm. Hmm, I don't see you in our in-house right away. Let me... And I don't see that you... Yeah, I don't see that you were in house now, and I didn't don't see that you checked out today. So um, I don't know if I, I cut a deal with housekeeping. Uh, uh, well, the right rates tonight for one of our rooms, the last two rooms we got, is free. It's free. Twenty nine before tax. It's free. It's free for free. Three twenty nine before tax. Yeah, but I'm staying under the free for free plan. Sorry, we don't offer that discount. I it's a five finger discount. Ask your mama. So it's gonna be three twenty nine before tax. Okay. You can pay it out of your own pocket. Alright, if the, if you're not gonna book a room, I'm gonna hang up here and then conclude business. No, I'm uh, I'm gonna stay in the room. I already let myself in. The 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 handle was loose, I gave it a jiggle and then a push. And I let myself in. All right. Well, if, if we're not going to book a room, then I'm going to hang up. Thank you for calling. Can you tell your Can you tell your boyfriend in the background to be quiet? This is Mount Hood, Oregon Resort. How can I help you? You can You can You can help by getting your hotel off of my land. What was that? I have ownership of this land that you built this monstrosity on. I have a napkin. I have ownership papers. I have the deed from a poker game back in 94. 
You're on my land. Okay, sir, I can't do anything about that. That's something you're gonna have to okay, take. Okay, well I'm gonna need you. everyone I'm gonna need everyone to get out of to move out of the out of the rooms and off of my land tonight. They need to go. Hey, Wilson Rachel Paris, can I help you? Yeah, there's a lot of things in my room. Um I have a little situation here because I when I use the toilet, I like to, you know, open all the doors and windows, and I can't seem to get this window open, and this door won't stay open. It keeps closing on me. Is there something I can do, like, to wedge it up and keep it open? Okay, who am I speaking with? Johnson. Kevin Johnson. Okay, and I'm you're in that saying, room that you assigned uh, me. Yeah. Okay. I just want to wedge then, these doors and windows open so when I when I excavate my bowels into the toilet, everyone can come and watch. Liquor store. This is Berta. How can I Hi. help you? Hi. Hi. Do you have liquor? Yeah, this is a liquor store, honey. Okay, but you have the the, the bottle that says liquor on it? Uh, let me check. Hold on. Oh, okay. I don't know how to work it. Like, do I just bend it? Do I slap it? Do I hold the lantern? I don't know how this works at all. We are adults right now, honey. Okay, how do I work it though? Do I take it and then I bend it? Is that how I open it? Yeah, yeah I have one right here. Uh, if I oh, you have I one already over there. Bend it. Yeah, I have it. If I maybe bend the glass, to, maybe you have to. Do, do I bend it? it? Well, no, no, no. It 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 seems to be bendable, but it's made out of glass. I'm very confused because I've never seen bendable glass before. Oh. Is this is this a new feature of the bottle? I think so, yeah. Okay, hold on. Let me let me just see here. Now, if I bend it this way... Ow! Um... You got it? No! It cut me! You told me to open it this way, and now I'm hurt. I need to see your papers right away. You have your papers? Yo, my pen, that tickles. Hello? Hello? Thank you for coming to Rock Casino Resort and Spa. This is Gina. How may I assist you? Thank you for calling Red Rock Casino Hello? Resort and Spa. Gina, how may I assist you? Hi. I heard you have a bowling alley, or no? Is that a lie? You need to speak. Did you have any questions about hours of operation before I connect you there? Yeah, well, uh, we're back here in where the machines are. We've gotten lost. Oh, and that's what you're looking for, is the bowling yeah, alley? Yeah, we're looking for the, yeah, the bowling alley, because we're stuck in the machine. The ball returned. We went in here looking for our ball, because... We had a 10-pound ball. It fell back here. You know, we, th we threw it. It went back here. But the guy, he said, oh, we can't find it. Can't find it. It never returned. So he said, oh, just go back there. But I can't find my way out. Uh, I'm a little scared, to be honest. And my phone battery is dying. So. Well, where are you yeah, around at? Do you see anything that you can Please point connected. out? Can... There's a machine. It's It's going. It's chugging away. It's moving the balls. And the pins, it's going up and down and side to side. Certainly, and the I'll go ahead and connect you through. to security. Oh, okay. Anything else I can assist you with before I connect you there? That should do it. That should do it. They'll Thank probably you. know how to get me out of here. Okay. Thank you. Have you. a great rest of your day. One moment. You too, honey. I love you all. Kisses. Security, how can I help you? Hi. We're in the bowling alley. Uh, the, the pin master, he said go back here. Cause my ball didn't return. I brought my ball from home. It went, it went through, but it never came back. And we looked, and no one took it. So he told me, "Go, go back there." But now I'm locked back here, and the machines are whirring. 
And I can't okay. find my way out. Okay, the phone battery's dying and the lights are dim. I can't see very well anyway. Uh, my sunglasses are all I have, and I can't see the, without them, so it's okay. very dark. Uh, so you're lost somewhere in the back of the house? Yeah, the back of the bowling machines. Like The pins are going up and down, and side to side. Uh, my ball yeah, is missing. So who, yeah, but who told you to go back there? The man, he said, go back there. I, I can't do it right now. He said he couldn't do it right now because he was busy. So, but he left the door open, so I, I went. Because he said, oh, just go back there. You know, I'm sure it's like just on the floor. It probably fell down. And so I got back here. I can't find my ball. It's very dark. Bobby. I can't see. Okay. Uh, okay. I don't know how to get out so, of here. I'll, I'll send I, I got there, turned okay? around. And I've been, okay. I was Sir, drinking at the bar there. I'm going to send someone your way. Well, I'm no, don't hang way, okay? up. You can't hang up. I'm scared. Hello? What kind of freaking cop out bull? Uncle Bye. Bowling Center, this is Kilo speaking. How may I help you? Hi, uh, did you just get off your weed break? It's okay, I'm cool. Santa Fe Bowling Center, Spencer, I can help you. Spencer, I'm back yes. here with the, the, the return because my ball, my 10 pound ball, I brought it home from home. I threw it, it went, and then it never came back. And I, I looked uh, at my neighbors here, they don't have it. So I went back here, but now I can't find my way out. And the lights are very dim. I don't know what's going on. Did I like, I don't know where I am really. I mean, I, okay. the ball went this direction, but I, I don't see it here. You're at the bowling center right now? Yeah, I'm back here in the machine room, I guess. There's machines okay. that are going rrr, and they're grinding. Okay, I see balls, and they're coming, and If pins. you're back there, you definitely can't be back there. Okay, but I'm stuck now. Because I, okay. I reached into one of the machines, and I tried to grab a ball, but my 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 the part with my, my clothes, it got caught under the ball, and it's a mechanism, and now I'm inside the machine. But yeah, I can't get out. Mm -hmm. Which lane? Well, I'm not sure which lane back here. I'm wearing sunglasses if it makes any difference. Yep, we'll send somebody back there. Uh, okay. All right, but I'm scared. All right, we'll send somebody right now. Okay. Golf course bowling, good evening. Hello? Hello, hello hi. Um, I have a few questions. Uh, I'm about to bring some kids in to bowl for the first time, and I needed to ask a few things. Yes. What? Do you have the uh, bumper? Do you have the bumpers available? Yeah, we we have a bumpers. If we put, if we put the bumper stuff for that lane, that's for everybody, because we don't have any oh, okay. automatic. Just do it by manually. Oh, is it? Oh, like the inflatable things that go in the gutters? Yeah. Is that what that it, is, and not yeah. the rails? It, okay. It, that line, all um, that line, that will be everybody have a gutter. Uh, uh, bubble. Okay, that's that's fine. That that's okay. fine. That's fine. Okay. Um, now, uh, let me ask also. Um, do you have kids' shoes size fives? Yeah, you have. We have. Okay. Shoes, um, we have and, and, shoes. and then they have. Uh -huh. They have favorite colors too. Do you have uh, black, black and blue balls? Balls? No. Uh, yeah, black have... and black or blue balls. Colors, black or blue balls? Oh no, we have red, green, black. Maybe that's the big, the uh, fifteen or sixteen pounder. Do you have one. Do you have ten pound balls? Do you have ten yeah. pound balls? Yeah, we have. But yeah. the, the color do you go, that is, do you, I think the color is red or yellow. Okay, because, cause, cause, ma'am, I'm in the back here where all the machines are. I thought the balls are back here. Like, I, I see all the machines, and they're handling the pins, and I'm back here right now, and I'm trying to find the balls. 
But where are the balls at? Oh, you see here at the back of that. I'm in, I'm in back with all the machines. Yeah. What happens when I flip this switch? What did, what happened? What happened out there? Hello? Hello? Yes, hold on. Yeah, I'm back here and I'm flipping switches. What did this do? What's this do? What happens what, when I do this? What, at the back? What, what, what are you doing at the back? Because I was looking for the balls. No, you can't go at the back. You should be the ball will be right here. In uh back uh back of the table, under the table. Yeah, but I'm in back here and now I don't know how to get out. No, I don't know. Ah, yes, hold on. How do I get out? Do I climb do I climb yeah. over the machine and back out the, back out the lane? Should I climb over the machine? That's just that's just an add on to her line to make her feel at home. She said, Oh, I love these substandard lines. Hello. Hi. Do I climb over the machine and back out? What happened? Yeah, what do I, I call do? the mechanics to come right over you there. Okay, I'm gonna start hitting this. I got a hammer. I'm gonna start hitting this thing with a hammer until okay. it stops, yes, so I can so get out. The mechanics will come right over. Clang, clang, okay. clang. Okay. I'm hitting it with a hammer. Listen to this. Clang, clang. Thank you for calling Wall Wall and Hampton Inn by Hilton. This is Sally. How may I help you? Hello. Hi. Hello, ma'am. Hi, it's Walla Walla Hampton Inn. How can I help you? Hi, um, I just wanted to let you guys know uh, the second floor is going to be closed for a private party for about the next hour and a half. So if you could just let people know that they're going to have to wait until we're done. Um, I don't think so. Yeah, well, we sub- we have a, a mo- we're doing a mobile bowling alley business, and some people hired us to come in and set up. So we set the hallway up on the second floor, uh, and we're up here up bowling. There. You're not. Cause I yeah, just we just set it up. We we just set it up. That's why I'm calling you. Do you like the wama wama? Sorry. I do. I'm talking about the wama wama. Yeah. I have your problem in my room is the wama wama. There's a problem in your room? Yeah, it's the wama wama. I have a problem. I have I have a I have a bloody nose, so I'm stuffed up. I have a problem in my room at the wama wama. I'm sorry, you're cutting off. I have a problem in my room at the Wama Wama. Thank you for calling the Marcus Whitman. This is Tom. How can I help you? Hello? Hello, Tom? Marcus Whitman. Yes. Oh, good, yeah. We got the bowling ball party up here on the second floor. I was wondering if you want to come down. You have the some what? fun. The what party? The bowling balls. We're having a bowling ball party. I don't know what that is. Bowling balls. We got everyone out here. And you're where? I'm right here. I'm by my door. And we got the pins and the bowling balls, and we're smoking cigars up here. Um, we're smoking cigars inside. You better not Wanna be smoking inside here? the hotel. Oh, uh, we're smoking. We're smoking. We're so smoked. We're smoking. I'm smoking. They're smoking. The balls are smoking. Anyway, the pins. Have, a, have a good day. You know, come on, come up here. Smoke my balls. Yeah. Hello, this is the Best Western in Wall Wall. My name's Andrew. How can I help you? Your name's not Andrew. Really? Hello? Hi. Are you sure? Hello? Yeah, hi. Hello? 
No, hey, don't don't be fucking ignorant, all right? Oh, there you go. I can hear you now. <laughs> all right, cool. You, you so uh, like we got we, we got a problem with the bo- the bowling pins aren't falling. <laughs> the bowling pins aren't falling. Yeah, well, I, we're in we're up in the hallway. We're in hallway two, lane two, and we're bowling, and they're not falling for me. <laughs> well, unfortunately for you, I'm a hotel, not a. Uh... Bowling alley. No, no. We set up. We set up a bowling alley here in the hotel. <laughs> well, I'm sure I would have seen that on the cameras by now. Uh, well, maybe your cameras are stupid. Uh, probably. What can I do for you? Uh, well, I need you to come shake the pins. Quality Inn and Suites in downtown Walla Walla. This is Kelly. How can I help you? Hey, Kelly. How you doing? Uh, this is Buck Bundy, and I wanted to know what makes this such a good quality. What makes it such a good quality in? Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, you're going to call yourself the quality in. I was just wondering what makes you the quality of the quality in. Um, well, our entire staff is very friendly, nice. It's a very good environment, nice, clean rooms. We are close to downtown, all the wineries, the dining, you name it, we're in walking distance of it. Do you employ uh, homosexuals at all? Um, I'm not sure what that has to do with anything. Well, I want to know about the diversity content of your employment staff, your staff employments. Uh, We're very diverse. Okay. Um, And... What are your going rates as far as um, the rooms? It uh, depends what you're looking for and when. I'm looking for. Uh, do you do double? Do you do two queen? Two queen rooms? We do. I'm looking for next week. It's like next Friday, the twenty eighth. Uh, next next Friday would be fantastic. And how many nights? Uh, it's going to be... Uh, that's a good question. I want to stay till Monday. I want to check out Monday after... What is it, Monday morning, 11 o'clock or something like that? Yes, it would be around 11 yeah, yeah. o'clock. Uh, yeah, 11, 11 o'clock Monday is fine. Um, but I do need to make sure there are two queen beds. What does that support? I'm allowed to have four up to four people in a room? Yes. Okay, because I've got ad- some like-minded men that I met online, and I want to I want to be comfortable. Okay, um, so how many adults per room? Uh, what well, 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 uh, two two to a bed, so four four total. Okay, and you're only looking for the one room, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ronaldo, settle down. Okay, so for one room, two queen beds for um, Friday and Saturday, it looks like it's 189 yeah. plus tax, and then oh, total uh, Sunday, for for three days. That's great. That's a good price. Well, no, that's just the rate for the night, and then Sunday the rate would drop down to 129 for the night. So that would give you a total estimate of 568 dollars and 26 cents for the three nights. Five six sixty eight. You guys are good yeah. with that. All right, yeah, they're good with that. They're good with that. Okay, would you like to go ahead and book we're trying, it? We're because because we're because we're going to split it, and I was just making sure that they're good with it. Oh, okay. Would you like to go All right, ahead? Guys, I mean, and... we'll book. We'll book it. Yeah, let's book it. They seem excited. Okay. And what's the last name? The last name is uh, On O N N. In the first? Hard. Is this a joke? No, I wish it was. My parents were not very nice to me when I was born. Uh, They began to be cruel to me at the age of 13 when I told them about the Rainbow Coalition. And now I have to deal with it until I get the money to legally change my name. And I appreciate if you didn't mock me as well. I'm not mocking you. I'm just making sure this isn't a joke. They didn't even give me. They, my, my parents didn't even give me their same last name. It was almost like a Joe Dirt situation. 
Okay, and what's the address? I well, I don't know what your address is. No, your address. We need to oh, have it on file. My, my, my. Oh, okay. It's 215 Horse Machine Ranch Road, and that's stable 311. And that's in Roy, New Mexico. And the zip code is 87743. And what's a good phone number? Uh, let's see. Ronaldo, can I put this under yours? All right. Let me grab this. I think he hit his toe. Right. He stubbed his toe. He's got ingrown toenails. He's very sensitive to stubbing of the toes. Uh huh. So, what's a good phone number? Just the one I called you from. Do your job. Um, I don't get to see that. So. Do your do your job. All right. Two one six. Seven one zero. Zero six six six. Okay, and what card would you like to put this on? Uh, I'm going to put it... Well, do you take debit, or does it have to be... Uh, does it have to be a credit card? It's got the logo on it. Okay, what's the logo? Is oh, it's a, a MasterCard. Card? Okay, and what's the number? MasterCard. It's 5285-8708-8210. Eight three six nine. Fuck this. And the expiration. Uh, four of twenty twenty six. Fuck. Oh. Fuck, man. You got a lot of stuff going on in the background there. Hello. Hello. Excuse me. Hello. Who are you? Who are you? What? We we need to know your name because we have a pizza delivery over at Motel 6 and we can't find the room. Ha ha. Huh? Oh, really? Because I can tell you right now, my husband... Go on. You have sat there and harassed me and harassed me on my show. W- w- on your show? Motherfucker, what the fuck, you punk-ass bitch? What? What? I just want to deliver this pizza. Are you guys okay? Yeah. Uh-huh. You guys are at the Motel 6, right? We got an order for the Motel 6, but I can't find the right room number. You fucking loser. Do you want your pizza or not? <laughs> yeah, whatever. Sir, this is not a joke. Meet me up somewhere and we'll see what you are, you little bitch. We're from we're from Domino's. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Well, listen to me. <laughs> Goofy son of a bitch. <laughs> Sir, I will throw this pizza on the ground right now. You're a fucking illiterate. You got a fucking degree, because I got a fucking degree. I got a felony. <laughs> don't give a fuck where you're from, bitch. Oh, I'm from your mom's house. Yeah, you got a fucking degree from fucking... Fucking... Yeah, you're not very good at this. Let's try it again. So, we'll restart. I'm from your mom's house. Some bullshit fucking online bullshit. Nope, still not very good. What? <laughs> should I call you should I call you in like an hour, give you time to practice? If you think you're bad, why don't you fucking talk to me then, boy? I then. Let's go do something about it. Give me your room number, we'll be there. 
You're talking shit? Sir, I'm literally delivering a fucking pizza. You're talking shit? You can't back it up, motherfucker. Motherfucker. Sir, sure, what You're is the room number? Joke. No. I'm going to tell you right now, buddy. Okay, thank you. Go get a fucking life. Get a life, you fucking bitch. Sir, I have a life. It's delivering fucking Domino's pizzas. So why are you making my life so hard? It's already miserable. Get a fuck. You call me down. Sir, I'm just wondering. You would be the first motherfucker to ever call me down. What is your name? I'm going to tell you that right now. Okay, tell us. You must be a bad motherfucker if you're going to calm me down. Sir, I just need to know where you live. Yeah, you're a fucking loser, dude! Wait, hang up and recall it. You can't even... Hello? Hang up and call it a different one again. Hello? Excuse me? Yeah, you're right. I love you. Who are you? I love you. You're right. Hotel 6 in Clarkston. Hey, how may I best Hi. you? Hi. Hi. How are you doing? Good. How are you doing? I'm doing great. I just found out there is such a thing as a Swiss cheesecake. Really? That sounds interesting. Yeah, I was making it in my room. <laughs> really? And yeah, and uh, I jammed my shoe in the toilet, and now it won't stop overflowing. Oh. So that's problem number one. Problem number two is the door is jammed, and I can't seem to open the door now. And the waters are coming. Oh, she's a coming. But I really want to make some of the Swiss cheesecake. Okay. So how can we make one work for the other? Uh, the door's the door. And the cheese is there. And the toilet is overflowing. Are you in one of our rooms? Yes. And I have quite uh, uh Quite a problem here, honestly. That's okay. a problem. I know I do not. I I cannot. I lost my my glasses in the flood. They floated away, and I have no idea what the room number is. Otherwise, I wouldn't be calling you. I I just look and I go, okay, I got the room number. We'll call them, and they'll be able to find me. But no. Uh, my caretaker was here earlier, and he's the one that set up the room. Now, he's through a service, so I don't know that it's under the service name or his name. I didn't catch his name. It just sent, here's service, you know, it was an app, servant number 427. Now, it said servant, which made me think, well, maybe this is a scam, and maybe this gentleman's actually some sort of a, a slave to someone here. Like, maybe, does he work for you? Are you enslaving people to help uh, the disenfranchised to get rooms? Uh, no, I'm not sure what you're talking about exactly, honestly. Oh, it was an app for the uh, hotel phone. So I installed it on there, and he came and he, he took care of everything. Like, he booked the room, and he he put me in, in the chair. But my glasses have floated away, and I cannot see where they went. And I'm afraid that if I walk anywhere, I'm going to step on them. So what's there's, your, there's what's problem your first number four. Last night. What's your first and last name? It's uh, Richard. And the Sauce. last name? S A U S E. My friends call me Dick. S A U S E. Yes, it's pronounced sauce. Okay, would the room be under someone else's name? Because I don't, I don't have that name in here. 
Wh- which name do you have? I don't know. That's why I'm asking you. My name you... is Dick. Right. I just I don't have that name. Okay, you don't have Mr. Sauce. No. Is there a different name that it, that your room could be under? Well, I don't know what the gentleman's name was. It just said Servant 427 on it, on the app. But maybe his name was, uh, it was something to do with the church. So maybe it's under a business name, the Church of the Machine. Um. I'm not seeing that either. And you have no way of finding out what your room number is? Not without possibly stepping on my my glasses, which are very expensive. And it took me quite a while to find uh, an eyeglass maker that could could make my glasses because they're telling me, oh, you you have the cataracts, oh, you have the glaucoma, oh, oh. But it turns out they're just lying. They're just lying to me. And it turns out my eyes are just fine. I just need a high prescription that most places won't won't produce correctly. And it also turns out that the the lady doctor I went to must have been huffing some like laughing gas or something because, boy, did she get the prescription wrong. Boy, howdy, I'm out two hundred dollars on a new pair of glasses. You know how that is. Yeah, that's no good. So I don't want to step on the good ones, you know. And they're floating away somewhere around here, and there's poo caca feces on them, too. Because I made a bowel movement before I got my shoe stuck in there while I was making the cheese, the Swiss cheesecake. Okay. So um, I'm currently sitting within, you know, the room, and there's things flowing by, and there's doo-doo caca feces everywhere. I, I think, and the door won't open. I'm very embarrassed. Okay. Is there any I'm not way a very good man. I, I'm a very bad man, in fact. Oh. Yeah, I'm very bad. It, why? Please help. I'm very bad. I, I get into these situations all the time. I can't take myself anywhere. Okay. I'm just... I have the ADHD and the, the OCD and all the things. They're going and they're flowing and they're, they're scooting by like a dog... No, and the poo-poo, and the caca, and the feces, and my glasses. God only knows where my glasses floated off to. Okay. I'm scared. Um, I'm not 100% sure what I'm supposed to do in this moment. Um, my coworker Please is... help. My, my coworker is going to be here any minute. Um, I wrote down your phone number. Oh. Can I give you a call back so he yes, can help me figure yes. out what room you're in? Yes, you can call me back. Yes, I will hold on to my phone, and I will be here waiting for you. Okay, okay, don't don't okay. lose your phone. Okay. Give me like. But I have minutes. I have one little problem. I have to go again, and I can't make it to the the bathroom because it's it's all just floating around here, and the bathroom door won't close. And there's a pigeon outside, and he's looking through the window, and he's staring at me. I can't go. I can't make when there's people or things looking at me. Okay. And they're seeing my genitals and everything. Okay. Well, um, I currently have a customer, so I'm going to... My coworker's going to be here any minute, and we can try and help okay. you. Okay. All right. Well, okay. I'm going to hang up, and you can call me back, okay? So I have to save my battery, because I don't want this thing flowing away, floating away either. Okay. All right. Okay, that's the plan. Okay, thank you. Yeah, of course. Okay, I love you. Okay, bye-bye. Say it back or it's weird. Um. Orleans Bowling Center, how can I help you? Hi. Hi there. How you doing? I'm great. How are you? Well, I'd be better. I'm stuck back here with the pins. My ball ball didn't come rolling back to me. So I went back here. And now I'm lost and stuck. I don't know how to get out of here. Where are you? The lighting is not very good. The pins, the balls and the pins are back here. They're rolling around. Where are you? 
back here in the back of house, I guess you say. Are you a customer? Yeah. Okay, you're My not ball supposed to be back there. Return. Yeah, but the guy said, he said, oh, I can't help you, sir. You have to wait. So I took matters in my own hands and went back here. And now I'm stuck. I can't find my way out. Okay, so we have stay a situation. All right, I'll stay here, but you better stay there. And find me. Yeah, please stay where you are. I'm staying. I'm staying. So Dwight will be loud one week and then quiet the next, and I don't know it until, you know, start doing calls, and then 20 minutes in, he'll flip out. And, yeah, hi. I'm in the room, and my door won't open, and my glasses have floated away. The toilet's overflowing. Um, I can't see, and I didn't set up the room myself. My my caretaker took it, but he's through a service, and I don't have, I don't have his number. I, it, it's like a random guy every time. It's like, you know, Grubhub for uh, caretaker. Sorry, I didn't get you. You're calling I'm somewhere? in a pickle. I'm calling from the toilet. Sir, which room you're calling from? I'm in the Galmutra room. Sorry? Galmutra room. It's full of cow urine. I've been indulging in Galmutra with my friends and family all day. And they left me here and the toilet's overflowing. Sir, you're calling in the wrong number. Isn't this the Gond Hotel? No. Oh. I'm smoking in here. Yeah. So bring it down. Tell them to bring it down. Hello? Thank you so much for calling to Studio 6 LA's. It's Jessica. How can I assist you? Hi. I just flew in. I need a room. You need a room? Uh, when? Yeah. Uh, we only left one pad. Okay, uh, how many, uh, how many, hold on, I'm typing a thing on my phone here. My friend needs to find me, uh, because I was flying the plane. I just flew in. My arms sure are tired. Ha-ha! What? Yeah, right, I so flew. I was flying, and I was flapping my wings. I just landed. And boy, are my arms tired. Okay. I'm flying. Oh. I fly the plane. I fly. I'm I'm sleepy. I want to go to sleep in your room. How can I assist you? So you want to book a room or? Yeah, I want to book a room so I can rest my arms, which are very tired from flying all day, because I was flapping my wings. Oh my god. Okay. So I'm gonna transfer you to the reservation, so you can talk. No, with no, the no, 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 no. But. But I'm already here. I'm in the room. I flapped my wings and I flew through a window and I'm in the room now. We got a, we got a situation here. Yeah, I'm in. What's the room number? Is well, this, What do you mean, what's the number? I don't know. I flew through the window. I'm in here through the window. I flew in. Newby, can I help you? Hi. Hi. Are you okay? I'm okay. Okay, what happened? I made a mess in the room. I made a mess with my shoes. You see, I walked in to a pile of goo-goo, doo-doo. You know, the, the cows and the bears and the bees. Well, I was over at the zoo. And you see... Insulin, how may I help you? Hi, I mistook uh, I mistook what I thought was a cow pie. It turns out it was a homeless man's uh, dingleberries. So that's besides the point. Uh, I'm here in the room. I, I stepped in homeless man's uh, poo poo caca feces and I accidentally tracked it in. Uh, you have cleaning supplies down there? I guess not. Hello. Hello. 
sir. Yes, my husband and I are wanting to check in. Uh, sorry? My husband and I want to check in. It's our anniversary. We love each other. Can you hear me? Sir? I want to make love to my husband in your hotel. <laughs> Hi, do you have any mother or sister who could be exported to the to the store to be sold? Like I'll I'll pay a hundred and seventy dollars for the mother. Hello. If you have it. Hi. Hi. Hi, beautiful. How are you? Hello. Okay. Oh. Traveling. Hi, I'm traveling out right now. Um, is that all right? Uh, yeah. I mean, are you already a guest in here? Well, no, no. I'm traveling in. I'm traveling out to the travel in. I'm in my oh. car. I'll be there soon. I just wanted to okay. make sure my bed will be ready. Um, that the the chocolates will be on the pillow every night and morning. Um, uh, that the sheets will be clean. And the towels will be dry, unlike the last time I was there, and the towels were covered in doo-doo caca feces from the previous guest. You know, I complained. I got on the internet, and I went on my Twitter account, and I complained to the customer support, and I got a phone call from your customer support, and they were very rude. They told me I shouldn't be doing that in my room. It was disgusting. And then they told me that their name was, was Frank... But I called your 800 number, and they said, oh, no, we don't have a Frank working for us. So who, what's the deal? Was it you? Yeah. Were I you calling know. me? I don't know what you're Did you say about? all the rude things? Were you the one that told me to, to go F myself? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Well, someone I I over there the called number. me. No. I think you have the wrong number. You need to I called the number back, call. sir. This is the number that called me and told me to I haven't myself. called you. I have, I don't know anyone. Well, I don't, why I haven't do you called have you. Number? I haven't called anyone at, at all. And how is Only it that... Only customers I'm, have called me. Right, so I'm calling you, you back because you called me. you please check where you are calling and where you are, uh, call, who called you before. This is the before. number. This is the no, number I, that I called me. Maybe somebody... Maybe some guest might have called you. I don't know, but uh, it, it's not me. How does a guest call me? Guests can call me from this number? They could use the phone, but yes, uh, it's not me who called you. Oh, that's terrible. That's really bad. You know, yeah, that's I don't know secure. why you're making this up, but I, I didn't call I'm you. I'm not Sorry. making this up, but you should, you know, you should have... Hello? Okay. I hear everything in chat. Very good, Ms. Bolivar. Can I help you? I'll let you get my, my brother on the phone, because I, I have been drinking. I'm driving. Okay, give me, bye. Give me, give, me this, give me this fucking phone. Hi. Hello? Hello? Thank you for calling Polly Hotel. How can I help you? This is Jaden speaking. Why? Hello? Why why is your why is your name that? I'll just ask you, I'm not trying to be offensive. I'm just I'm Hello. Oh. Where mm. hotel can I help you? Hi, um I have a problem in my room. Yes, what is your room number? Uh, I'm in 215. 215, okay. What is the problem? Yes. Uh, well, when I got to my room, I was under the understanding there would be amenities. Oh, okay. So do, um, no. do we have the coffee machine in there? Do you find coffee? But nothing else. Yeah, there were, there were so, uh, from what I read online, there was supposed to be a very strong big man uh, in here to dick me down. I'm sorry? Yeah, it said online if I booked this room with the promo code uh, Hyphonics that I would get the amenities. I'd get the coffee maker, the coffee, and then a, a, a scantily clad man in leather jumpers to come and dick me down. Of course, but we have we have that available right now. 
Maybe no, tomorrow. no, it said right here. I used the code. I used the code Hyphonics, and it said that the the man would come with the Heinz fifty seven sauce and dick me down. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. We don't have that service for you. I think you called to the wrong hotel. If you have a one, if you have a one sauce, that's fine. I'm not, I'm not stingy, but it may burn more than the. I mean, the Heinz fifty seven is more of a tangy vinegar, uh, and the the A one is just a peppercorn. Oh, of course. But I do need course. some. Okay, I sir, do need, I'm so I do need sorry. someone to come dick me down. Come dick me down. That's amazing. Uh, but I'm working. I don't have time for this. Thank you so much for calling. I need someone to make me bite my pillow. <laughs> yeah. You are calling the Chamberlain in West Hollywood. I uh, my finger's stuck inside. Sorry. Yeah, there's a hole in my wall. And there's some some writing on the wall that said, enter if you dare. And I put my finger in, and now I'm stuck inside of someone on the other side of the wall. Oh, no. Yeah. May they're I not, ask like, your they're suite clenching number? Down. They, won't, they, won't, they won't let go. I'm in 215. 215? Yeah, I had to use voice call. I had to use, I said, Alexa, Dial hotel because my finger is stuck in the wall inside of someone. They're clenching down. I can't dial. I can't reach the phone. Okay. What is the last name? My last name is Johnson. That's not what I have on the reservation. What do you have on the reservation? That's not the last name that I have on the reservation. Do you only have one reservation at the hotel? For that suite number, yes. Yeah, yeah, Johnson. Uh, well, I didn't rent it. I'm, you asked my name. I don't. I, I came with the man I met on Tinder. He's the one that rented it. Got it. Do you know his last name? I don't. Uh, he, he goes by. He said his name was Splinter. And he kept telling me yeah, about sorry, these teenage shelled, hard-shelled boys that he taught karate to. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't have anybody under that. He, 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 came into, he came to the room in a Chuck E. Cheese costume. Yeah, I didn't see him. I'm just going to place you on a brief hold you there know? with me. No. Oh, yeah, hold me. Good evening, front desk. Sarah, how many sisters do Huh? Good evening, Sunset Marquis. How many you I sneezed. First, better. Good evening, Sunset Marquis. Why are you why are you laugh at me? I sneezed and you hung up on me. That was crazy. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I had a guest in front of me. How can I help you? Oh well, well, fuck, fuck them! I had a sneeze and and you mocked you mocked me. How can I assist you? So, uh, what you doing? I am sitting at the front desk waiting to answer your question. So, um, I I gotta make a complaint. Somebody came to my room. They knocked on my door. I thought it was my DoorDash guy, and when they knocked and I answered the door. Uh, the person threw confetti in my face and yelled, surprise, you're gay, and then they ran away. What's your room number? 215. It was ridiculous. It was like a, it was like a Don Rickles fucking thing. You know, like He ran up and he shot confetti in my face. He's like, surprise, you're gay, and then he ran off. What's your last name? Johnson. What's your, what's your, la- what's your last name? I am not going to give that out. Well, how come you get to ask me? I don't get to ask you. Because I'm confirming guest information. Oh. I mean, all right. I I guess you're on the up and up. Continue. I don't have a Johnson in room 215. Ah, you don't have a dick. I, I don't. Why not? Every woman should have one, whether it's a man or a uh, sexual pleasure device that vibrates and goes, or a cell phone with extra battery capacity that you could put down your pants. 
and then you go and you call you sign up for a lot of telemarketing calls and then you're just at work like that is this how you entertain yourself on Fridays well I usually save it for Saturday but yeah Friday's good this week it must be a good day to prank call a hotel then it does it's very lucrative um I then take the money and I pass it on to my congressman to try to get them reelected uh, because there's a lot of causes I believe in. That sounds like a worthy cause, except for this, it's not lucrative. It is lucrative, and I donate to Gavin Newsom all the time. I donate, I donate money so he can afford hair gel and some mousse. It seems like a large bill, actually. Uh, you know, I'm not saying I'm paying for the whole thing. I'm saying I just, you know, it, it, I cut into the, I cut into the cost. You know, I, I, I try to help. You know, he's got to look good. He's got to look good. He's very sexual. You know, you're doing God's work. Yeah, I have a massive slush fund. You know that, that is amazing. I, I could bring you into the fold. You could be one of my slush, one of my slushes. I already have a job. Yeah, but the mine pays more, and it's a uh, it's a nonprofit, so you would be really be doing God's work. But you don't even know how much I make. Well, it doesn't matter because us nonprofits, we gotta spend money because we can't profit. So, like, even if I had a hundred grand left and it was the last day of the quarter, I would give it all to you. That sounds very fraud like. And you, and no, 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 no. That's very legal like. And you got a you got a hot guy as a boss. Like I'm hairy, I'm Italian, I smell like garlic, but I, I look good. Mm, I would be that would be subjective for preference. What would be subjective? Your attractiveness. No, I'm not into B, uh, BDSM or anything like that. No. Well, you said that you're attractive. I said that's subjective. But well, you would you say the same thing about a magnet? Were you, so were you trying to say you don't like men? No, but I don't know what you oh, look you like. Oh, you don't? Oh, shit, I was, bar- I was barking up the wrong tree already. No, I said that I that I don't think my preference or, or orientation matters. Your orient- no, no, uh, you haven't signed up yet. I can't sign you up for orientation quite yet. I don't know if you're qualified. Someone hired me, so someone thought I was qualified for something. Well, yeah, for that job. I mean, a, a monkey with a tack hammer could do your job. That, I mean, I've kept a conversation with you for five minutes. I don't can a monkey do that. Uh, I mean, I would probably talk to a monkey for twenty-five minutes to tell you the truth. So you need you need to play a little catch-up. Well, I guess I'll hang up because if a monkey's more interesting, then then I'm probably not worth your time. Hey, don't 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 say monkey like that, please, because that sounds racist on your part, and that's really going to affect your job performance here at the company. I, I'm not even hired yet, and I'm already being fired. No, you're you're being reprimanded already. Mm. Well, Mr. Johnson, it's been a pleasure, but I'm going to have to hang up now. Yeah, that's what they all say, yeah. Yeah, I mean, to you, probably a lot of women don't say it's been a pleasure, but, you know. No, no, you can't take it back now. Too no, late. I'm saying, mm, nope. takesy back. Nope. No, take back. no take backsies, nope. Well, don't be Indian giving and- over there. I'll, I will I will come over there and I'll give you such an Indian burn right on your forearm. Doesn't that sound a little racist, actually? Nope. Because an Indian person came up with it. So I'm honoring them. All right. Well, it's been real. It has been real. And you need diversity training so you don't make that mistake in the future. If you ever end up visiting our establishment, love to say hi. Okay. I'll be there in 15 minutes. Wonderful. Yeah. That's what they all say. Ah. Ah, I'm gonna I'm gonna beep at you. I'm gonna meep meep, I'm meep meep like a roadrunner when I come in there. Yeah. Mm, mm. Probably not. All right. Bye bye. <laughs>